Hello friends, welcome to the next section in our All Data Learning series. And in this series, we'll learn how to create the All Data Service to create and display goods received node, that is GR document, which is done manually through transaction code MIGO. So what all the details we are going to learn and what is the objective of this project? So in this project, the objective is to create and display the goods received node, that is GR against the purchase order, which is done in SAP to transaction code MIGO. Here, whenever you want to display, you have to select this A04 display, enter document number. So system display all the header and the line item information. And when you want to create the GR, then you have to select this goods received node. So this is the main agenda of this series. So what all we'll learn? So first we'll learn how to create the data project, how to create the header and item entity types, and also to create the association and navigation properties. Then I will directly jump to implement the get header entity method. And after that, directly to the get expanded entity and the create deep entity method. Here, I'm not going to implement the item level entity or update, delete, etc. Because my agenda, my objectives are very clear. I want to display GR details or create the GR. So when you talk about GR, there will be one header and multiple line items while displaying as well as to create. So that's why here my main intention will be to explain the implementation part of the get expanded entity and the create deep entity. After this, we'll also learn how to do exceptional handling in case of any error while creating the GR. So how we'll pass that message back to the front end system. Okay, and for all this GR creation, we'll make use of BAPI. And after this, we'll test the service for both create and display document. So whenever there is success, this is a get call. You can see this is a get call, the dollar expand. This is the navigation property. And here you can see the 200 that is success header. And the bottom, you will able to see the line items. So this is to get call, display GR details. Fine. And next, this is the post call to create the GR. In that case, we can use the same output as a request. We can change the data and display the GR details. And once the GR is successfully posted, we'll get back the 201 in the output in the green color. Okay. And in case of any error, system should return the status code 4 series 400 with the message. What is the error? This is also post call. And here you can see the error message clearly. That is the purchase order quantity exceeded by the 24 kg. So this is the overall agenda of this project. So from next session, first we learn the manual process, how the PO is created, how the GR is done. Then we learn the make use of BAPI. And then we'll start the project with transition code SEGW. Okay, so let's meet in the next lecture to start our project. Thank you.